All right, speaking of blue sky, Stephen, blue skies outside yeah, this noon time. A little chilly though, temperatures in the 40s, so you know, despite the sunshine, it certainly does feel much cooler out there, and that breeze continues, although not as gusty as yesterday. Hmm. Still have the extra layer with you, and you will go out the door this afternoon, looking at dry conditions continuing, uh, the fire threats also there as well, so uh, kind of just going along here with the uh, same uh, theme over the last several days, and here is uh, providencing the blue sky and sunshine as well, and uh, those chilly temperatures, 40s across the board 45 in Providence 46 in Newport 44 in Smithfield 48 in New Bedford notice the winds out of the northeast so it's a cooler wind making its way down uh, from the north and east again keeping us on the chilly side for today radar is quiet as has been the case the really last several days and we are looking at that elevated fire risk continuing for today across the entire area gusty wind still continuing as well as the dry ground and the dry air in place now as we go into the next couple of days this will only get worse as we go forward as well for friday and saturday but we'll talk about that in a second elevated fire risk does continue like i said not much rainfall in that seven day forecast and temperatures are going to be rebounding a bit as we go through the weekend and we'll be back into the 50s and even a couple 60s in there as well. Satellite and radar looking at a storm system off to the west, and you would look at this and say, oh, this is heading right for us. But unfortunately, high pressure is in control, which means dry weather. It's kind of like a wall in the atmosphere, so you can kind of see this whole area is like a shield in the atmosphere, and it's keeping the rainfall off to the west. So we're not going to be seeing any rainfall from that system. Here's a better look at it for you. Low pressure off to the west. Here's that rainfall across parts of the uh, mid-Atlantic region, and notice it kind of hits that wall and fizzles on out and actually transfers the energy from that system to a new offshore system down off the Carolina coastline down to the bottom of your screen. That stays to the south, so we're staying dry. And then watching another system off to the north and east. It tries to work its way back in from the east back to the west. Unfortunately, it doesn't get all that close to us, gives us some extra clouds. Uh, but other than that, looking at dry conditions continuing through our Friday and even into our Saturday. Here's the snapshot of Saturday 8 a.m. seeing Sunshine, clear skies and northwest wind, gusty winds as well as we head into the weekend. Again, that fire threat will be there for our Saturday and staying dry all the way through Saturday night and even into Sunday as well. This afternoon's forecast, cold, dry temperatures, like I said, upper 40s will do it. Staying quiet, though, through the evening hours, clear skies expected as we go into tonight. A very cold night expected in early Friday morning, uh, looking at those temperatures, upper 20s to around 30 degrees and partly cloudy skies. And again, that northwest wind does continue about 5 to 10. So keeping it on the cold side as we go into Friday and then looking at those temperatures a little bit warmer, but not that much. You know, today's upper 40s. Tomorrow's looking at mid 50s for highs and again, staying gusty as well. So here is that seven day forecast for you. And notice not a whole lot of rain in this seven day forecast as we go to the weekend, seeing Temperatures rebounding into the low 60s, milder for Sunday. Patriots at home and uh, looking at temperatures staying in the 50s to around 60 over the next several days. But notice no rainfall in that seven day, a shower possible on Monday and perhaps and this is, you know, off the seven day way into you know, the end of next week. We could be seeing, uh, you know, some more beneficial rain as we go into Thursday and Friday of next week, but still several days away. Wow. I'll be watching that closely. Wow, this pattern continues. The dry theme goes on. We need some rain desperately. We do. All right. Thanks, Stephen. Here's a look at the stories we're working on.